As a kid growing up, it was like I started gymnastics because I saw someone do gymnastics and I was inspired by them, and I hope that I can do that for all the girls here. So, When the average 16-year-old goes to the mall, this isn't exactly uh, <laughs> what it's like for them. Yeah, I mean, I was walking upstairs and they started chanting my name. I was like, people go shopping here. <laughs> this is crazy. Have you gotten used to this? Um, no. She says that, yeah, she has not gotten used to it yet, but oh my goodness, they were so excited to see her fans of all ages. Uh, that's her youngest fan, I believe, last night, playing a little hard to get. So over the course of the last year, you won the Olympic gold medal and the Dancing with the Stars mirror ball trophy. She is incredible. What a year for you. It's been absolutely amazing. It's definitely been a big whirlwind, but it's been a lot of fun. You know, when the average 16-year-old goes to the mall, this isn't exactly uh, <laughs> what it's like wow. for them. Yeah, I mean, I was walking upstairs and they started chanting my name. I was like, people go shopping here. <laughs> this is crazy. Have you gotten used to this? Um, no, definitely not. I mean, it's still very exciting to be able to go out and uh, see all these girls that want to come see me. I'm so surprised still. <laughs> now, you grew up in New Jersey. So, did you ever come out to Long Island um, prior to this? Uh, I think maybe once or twice. Maybe for a meet or two or something like that, but yeah. So what is it like for you meeting all of these girls who aspire to be like you? It's amazing. I mean, as a kid growing up, it was like I started gymnastics because I saw someone do gymnastics and I was inspired by them and I hope that I can do that for all the girls here. So, I mean, they are so excited to meet you. Are you guys excited to meet Lori? I mean, I, I'd say, I'd say yes. I mean, that's a welcome to Long Island if I ever heard one. So when you don't have screaming fans around you, do you get to be just a regular 16-year-old ever? Um, sometimes. I mean, if I go incognito. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, yeah, a lot of times I'll go, like, get my nails done with my sister or I'll be able to go out to eat with my family. And uh, moments like those are really sweet as well. I mean, you've been going, going, going. Have you had a second to just kind of stop and reflect on this last year and take it all in? I mean, I get a day or two here and there, but uh, besides that, I definitely am still traveling a lot. And uh, at some point, I'll be taking like three plane rides a day or something like that. Yeah, but it's it's so much fun, and this is an amazing opportunity. On Monday night, you were at Dancing with the Stars, cheering your friend Simone Biles on. What advice have you given to her? Uh, I told her to wear socks with her shoes so she doesn't get blisters. <laughs> now, that is pro advice. <laughs> so what is next for you? Well, I am doing a couple of book tours, meet and greets, and things like that, and also possibly coming back to gymnastics just because, I mean, I had such a great time in... Lori, they love you! <laughs> I had such a great time in uh, 2016. I'd love to come back for 2020. That is awesome. Well, we wish you all of the best. Um, thank you for doing this with us, and, and thanks for being so good to our fans here. Thank you. So nice to meet you.